everybody. I'm Ginny Schuster. Thank you for joining us on Zoom In with Ginny Panur. Please like, subscribe, and comment. To Hi, everybody. I'm Ginny Schuster, and you are with us at Zoom In with Ginny Panur. Today, I am thrilled to have with me Gary Rogers, who owns Company Flix. Now, I have to tell you a little bit about this world-renowned guy. I met him through somebody that I know, and lo and behold, when I connected with this guy, boy, my day just got brightened up. He helped me so much with my business. He helped me come up with an elevator pitch, and I want to share the great information, how he got into this, and get you thinking about some of the fears you may overcome by working with him. So let's dive in, Gary. Let's tell the viewers how you got into this. And wait, I need to add, oh, he's worked with ABC, Toyota, NBC, Fox, and his big name is Charlton Heston. Now, now you know we're dealing with the big folks. So Gary, let's have you take it from here. Hey, I'm just an ordinary grandpa. <laughs> There's nothing special <laughs> about me, but thank you for your kind words. I love working with you, Ginny. Uh, uh, we had the pleasure of meeting with each other. Oh, gosh, it's been several months now, and you've gone through my course, uh, and I just love working with you. You are a fireball, and uh, you're going to be a great star. Uh, uh, what was the question again? I forgot what you asked. <laughs> well, how did you get into this business? Well, I started uh, years ago with 3M Company as a salesman. Uh, I did well at sales. They promoted me to a sales trainer, a a training other salespeople how to sell. And then they uh, made me a, a training manager teaching all kinds of courses, one of which was public speaking skills and presentation skills. And I, I had a crazy idea. This was years ago, long before home video. And 3M had just come out with a big, huge cassette about that big uh, industrial videotape. Uh, I talked them into putting a video recorder and a camera in our training room where we would uh, tape uh, the corporate managers giving their speeches. When they saw that uh, the mistakes they were making, it, oh, my gosh, am I really <laughs> doing that? It, uh, pictures worth a thousand words and it uh, revolutionized our training virtually overnight. I fell in love with video at that time. 10 years later, uh, I formed, uh, I left 3M company and built my own production company. I spent the next 35 years in the television production motion picture industry, uh, producing television commercials, infomercials, corporate videos for many of the great companies uh, in the world. Uh, our clients included people like AT&T, Motorola, Mitsubishi, Procter & Gamble, uh, had a lot of chance to uh, uh, direct uh, many Hollywood stars, including Academy Award winning actor Charlton Heston. And I tell everybody, if I can direct Moses, I'm not going to have any problem at all uh, directing anybody using a webcam. <laughs> I believe it. I can tell with your enthusiasm, who can't, who doesn't want to work with you? You make it so easy. So Gary, what, tell people how they go about doing it. Let's talk about the elevator pitch and how is it that people connect with you to get going? I know for myself, I was stumbling over words and you just made it so easy to, to make it flow. Well, I spent many years uh, helping people uh, promote their businesses through television commercials and such. I, I retired about uh, 13 years ago. Uh, uh, that lasted all of two weeks. I, I just got <laughs> so sick of sitting around doing nothing. Uh, I started thinking, what can I do with the rest of my life? And just then, uh, webcams were starting to become popular on the internet. And I thought, my gosh, that's something I can certainly help people with. It is a whole new world, Ginny. Uh, literally since the pandemic, everybody is on webcams today. 
this is the most powerful promotional tool, training tool, and sales tool I've ever seen in my life. But most people don't even have a clue how to use it. My job is to work with people uh, in helping them promote and expand their businesses simply by using a, a webcam. There's so many things that you can do with it. But again, if, you're, if you don't have training, uh, people find it difficult to start. Uh, uh, my job is working with them and how they can, uh, again, expand and uh, build a business using a webcam. That's, that sounds great. And even if people just have an idea, we were discussing a little bit earlier that many people have a fear of public speaking. How is it that you work? I know for myself, you made it so easy for me and I did practice. How is it that people get started overcoming that fear? Well, it's a great question. The, the number one fear, number one fear that people have throughout the entire world is public speaking. Isn't that uh, the truth? Bad. Yes. I, it, it makes my blood boil in, in my country. Uh, you can go through high school and most college courses, uh, degrees don't require speech. And to me, that's almost criminal. Little babies learn how to talk, but nobody really teaches them how to communicate through speech. Uh, uh, I go to networking events constantly where people get in front of a webcam and they just struggle. They ramble, they wander, they don't know what to say, they don't know how to say it to, to get impact and power, uh, delivery skills. Uh, uh, it really is sad that uh, people struggle with such a simple thing as, as speaking, and it's still the number one fear that most people have. Uh, in fact, Warren Buffett, if you go to YouTube right now, you can find a video of him talking about when he graduated from high school and went into college, he was so deathly frightened of public speaking. He said just the thought of speaking in front of a, a, a group would literally cause him to throw up. What did he do? He confronted his fears. He enrolled in a public speaking skills course, and he said it literally changed his life. Uh, first thing you need to, to know how to communicate, how to promote yourself, your product, your business, uh, your course, whatever it is you're promoting. Uh, and the, one of the greatest things you can do is start learning how to use this little webcam. Oh, that's the truth. I know I had a fear of it and I kept challenging myself. I do a couple days and then I would stop and then I do a couple more days and stop. And it wasn't until I came along to you and I loved what he put together. Let me just say a couple of the words that, that Gary came up with for me was, when I was young, I thought old people were just complainers, talking about their aches and pains and lack of sleep and other health issues. Now, who wouldn't listen to you? When I say that word in front of a networking group, they look at me and you can see their, their smile come and I go, well, now that I'm one of those people and Gary is so much fun to work with. But Gary, more than that, what I also appreciate is when we get together, you have a group session and you, one of our discussions was talking about the presentations. So it's great to come up with uh, your elevator pitch. What you helped me with tremendously was when you, you said, it's easy. The free session is you tell a little bit about your product and ask questions. My goodness, when you said that to me, it just took a huge weight off my shoulder. I thought that I had to do all the talking. And when I talk, I can get to monotone and nobody's going to listen to me. Once you said that to me, oh my goodness, that just made a total difference in my whole life and my product. I want you to know that and share that with all everybody out there. Well, thank you so much. Uh, it's so fun to work with people. Uh, uh, I mentioned I started years and years ago. As you can see, I'm an old man. I've been around a long time. Uh, 
uh, in sales. Um, and that's the one thing that most, that most people starting a course, uh, starting a business, uh, uh, sales is a dirty word to most people. They hate <laughs> Uh, salespeople, uh, they think salespeople are pushy and they don't want to do anything to appear like they're selling something. True. Uh, good salespeople, good salespeople listen to people and ask questions uh, to determine how or if they even have a prospect. Uh, and good salespeople literally are not doing nothing but helping people solve problems. If you can help people uh, solve a problem, you've got a potential client. Uh, th and that's all sales is, is helping people solve a problem. Oh, yes, exactly. And we get so wrapped up in ourselves and our product, we forget about that a lot of times. Yeah, uh, I mean, we work together in developing your presentation. What I do for all of my clients is produce a little one minute video. Uh, anybody that's been on the internet knows that video is number one. Uh, a picture's worth a thousand words. You've heard it all your life. But how do you produce a promotional video? Most people don't have a clue how to do that. And I work with them in, in helping them write their script. 60 seconds can go by very, very quickly. And you've got to really think about the words you want to say. And those words, every one of them need to be really powerful to capture the attention of your audience. Uh, and then once we've got the, the words down, uh, the words are absolutely worthless unless people deliver them properly. Uh, it, and, and that's the big key. And now we're getting more into public speaking and presentation skills. Most people get on a webcam and make every mistake in the book. Uh, what I try to do is help them make those words come alive. The worst mistake that people make as soon as they turn on the webcam and 99% of every single person I talk to makes this mistake. Most people are on laptops. And if I were on my, I'm on a desktop, but it doesn't matter if I were on a laptop or a desktop, most people want to see the people that they're talking to. And you can't do that with a webcam. If I were on a laptop, I'd be looking down at the person or persons I'm talking to. Right now, I've lost connection with you, Jenny, and every single one of your viewers. Nobody feels like I'm talking to them right now. Uh, I'm looking down at you on my laptop, and I need to be looking in the camera. Now, every one of your viewers feel like I'm talking directly to them. It's the worst mistake you can make. If you're talking to somebody in person, you're going to look at them when you're talking to them. If you're looking away at them, that's just rude. I mean, they're, unfortunately, they're in the camera uh, when you're talking to them on a webcam. You need to realize that uh, you got to look straight into that camera if you want them to feel uh, connected. It's the worst mistake that everybody makes. And it's so simple to correct. All you got to do is look at that camera. But when you look at the camera, you cannot see the people you're talking to. Well, I found a secret uh, a lot of years ago. I spent the first three years coaching, uh, just looking at the camera. It drove me crazy. I couldn't see the people I was talking to. And then I found a secret. We don't have the time to go through it and explain it and how I'm doing it. Uh, but if your uh, uh, viewers come to the free webcam workshop, I will train them and teach them exactly how to look straight at the people they're talking to and uh, feel connected uh, on the other end. Uh, it, it's revolutionary, literally, for anybody using a webcam. I just think the world of you, and I thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for allowing me to be on your program. Well, thank you, Gary, so much. Thank you for taking time out today to share all this terrific information with our viewers. And I look forward to them commenting, liking, and responding. Click that Connect with Gary Rogers. That would be so much fun. You can see he makes it such a delight to work with. Thank you for your time today. Thank you.